Hey guys, welcome to our channel. This is Andrea and I am here today with an Aldi haul. I have not been to Aldi in quite a while, but my in-laws, Howard's parents, are coming tomorrow and there are some things um, that I wanted to pick up from Aldi and so here we are. So I will jump right in. I spent about $62 and some change. So I'll start over here. I grabbed some spinach. My in-laws are pretty healthy eaters and my father-in-law does not eat meat. So I got a lot of produce for him and I also have some fish in the freezer for him. Um, but I got some spinach and then I also got some tomatoes. And then I was really excited because they had nectarines on sale. And this bag of nectarines, I think it's two pounds. I think it's two pounds was $3.29. I also grabbed some bananas because they do eat bananas. And I also grabbed some zucchini. I'm not sure if they eat zucchini, but I thought I'd just grab it anyway. Um, I picked up some broccoli and also some cabbage. And I also grabbed some Brussels sprouts. Got two bags of Brussels sprouts. And I usually just chop those up, stir fry it with a little bit of um, olive oil. And then green onions, just because I like to have those on hand. And I use it green onions in a lot of different things. I'll go back here. Now, I've never bought this before, but this looks like something my mother-in-law would probably like. So I wanted to give it a try. Um, and it is crispy brown rice and corn crisp, brown and golden flax, chia, quinoa, and sea salt. So I thought she might enjoy that. And then... I just grabbed two of these snack packs. I've had them before and I really like them. It's just cre uh, strawberry cream cheese and they call them graham crackers, but they're really, they don't have the texture of a graham cracker. They're really like a, a crunchy cookie and they're very tasty. So I just grabbed two packages of that, of those I should say. And then I didn't even know that they were putting their crescent rolls in bags now, not the tubes. I think that's pretty cool. So I just grabbed a bag because I wanted to try it. And these were $1.99 or $1.95. I cannot remember. And then I've heard a lot of really good things about these buttermilk biscuits. These were in the freezer section. You get 12 biscuits. And I think these are a little over $3, I think. And a lot of people said that they are much better than the Pillsbury variety. So I was excited to give those a try. Um, I grabbed these white cheddar puffs. Um, my in-laws may like it, but I also like these too. I've tried to get Harrison, my four-year-old, to, to give them a try, but he wasn't really into them, but maybe he'll try them this time around. And then I just grabbed this for our pantry. This is actually pretty good. I prefer it to the Velveeta. Now, I don't usually make this because I do make a homemade stroganoff, which I am gonna show on our channel, but this is really great just to have in the pantry for those nights where you really need a quick meal. And this, like I said, is pretty tasty. Um, my father-in-law drinks almond milk, the unsweetened variety, so I grabbed that for him and they drink this specific brand. And then I just like to have whipped topping and I needed some, so I grabbed it completely out of my jasmine rice. I have not bought jasmine rice from Aldi in a while, but this is not, I'm not sure if this is the same brand of rice, um, jasmine rice, because the packaging is different, but, um, and the price of course has gone up. It's now like six bucks and it used to be a lot cheaper than that. And then I saw this and I'd never seen it before. I'm not a big dark chocolate person, but this sounded interesting and I've never had it before. Dark um, chocolate covered freeze dried strawberries and it looked pretty good. And here are the nutrition facts on the back. And then I needed some plastic wrap, so I just grabbed some. And normally, I used to always buy their cheese tortellini in the refrigerated section, but I haven't seen it in a while. And I just happened to notice the um, shelf stable cheese tortellini by the pasta. So I decided to give it a try. It's the same exact size as the one that they used to sell in the refrigerated section. And it's kind of shrink wrapped. Um, so I hope it tastes as good as the one that I used to buy all the time. 
grabbed some chicken breast um, just to have for lunch meat. And then I grabbed these black bean chipotle burgers for my father-in-law. I've never had them before, but I know um, we're gonna grill some just regular beef hamburgers. And so I wanted him to have a burger too. So I grabbed this for him and you get four of them. And they were a $1.99. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. And then I just really like this cheese bread. I buy it all the time when they have it. I love this sharp cheddar cheese bread. And then I just grabbed some snacking cheese and this is habanero jack. It has habaneros and it also has jalapeno peppers. So this is everything that I grabbed on my quick fill-in haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.